Hey friends! Welcome to today's video. Yeah, that's super weird to say. You know what, I know what day this is going up, so happy Friday. I hope you guys are having a fantastic Friday. I was not planning on filming today. It is my Wednesday, and I have gotten so much done. And you know why? Because the great crisis of Facebook and Instagram are down. <laughs> How you guys holding up? Y'all okay? <laughs> it's been three hours without Instagram. Is this what the end of the world feels like? I'm just kidding, but kind of not. It's a little weird not having like social media to turn to. I kind of feel like I need to be cut off. Like I'm jonesing a little bit. So thank you so much Instagram and Facebook for giving me the much needed break that I just would never take myself. Love that for us. How am I supposed to keep up with people's lives? Uh, it just Anyway, that's not why you're here today. Welcome to today's vlog. I um, was not planning on filming today. I got my whole house clean, which I'll give you guys a little sneak peek of, but it is Wednesday. Did I say that? I did. I don't wanna cook. I cleaned this whole entire house today. It looks amazing, except there's a sink full of dishes because the dishwasher is going. Don't judge me. But I am gonna pick up easy dinner. So that means a little quick trip into Publix, which you'll probably see a few things. I'm gonna see if I can find the Rebel Creamery ice cream. Um, yeah, I really want that. So I will give you all, guys also a keto update on John and I. We're doing really good. Yesterday kind of sucked for me um, as far as like how I was feeling, but today I feel so much better. Whew. Hi, and I'm gonna tell you kind of why I think I'm feeling better and some things I'm figuring out doing keto all over again for the 50th time. <laughs> oh, also, I made a really funny um, TikTok about Target, so I'm gonna go ahead and answer that now. Just did a bad thing. I regret the thing I did. Wondering what it is. I'll tell you what I did. I did a bad Thank you. Wait, no, I'm not. Maybe I will. We'll see. Did you do it, Lauren? Did you insert it? Who knows? But I'm gonna run to Publix really quick before I have to go get Ella from school, so come come with me. And then I'm gonna show you guys what we do on like fast food, not really fast food, you thought you tried it, fast food keto dinner night. What I'm gonna make for me and what we're gonna have and, okay, cool. Okay, hey, so there's a GNC in the same plaza as my Publix. And I've been craving chips like a mother. And they have smart sweet gummies here too. So I think I'm gonna grab some of those things. That's a huge suggestion I would suggest to you guys if you are really freaking dying on keto is stock up on things that you guys really truly love in real life. I love chips and I love candy. And you just can't get gummies. Like I've tried making them and it just tastes like jello and it sucks. So just a thought. Okay, my favorite. Hello. Good, how are you? Well, I did it, Asa. I vlogged in the store. Are you so proud? I got some things I'll obviously show you when I get home. Now I have to haul ass to Publix. Okay, this is the stickler, vlogging in Publix. Folks, I need parchment paper. I need wings. I need what do I need? Snack for Ella. I think that's it. And water bottle. Everybody's staring at me. That's fine. I'm totally fine with this. <laughs> we love a sale, you guys. Publix was like the Hunger Games in there. I've never had that many people stop and talk to me before. This Italian man stops me in the butter aisle. Butter was $4.85. He was upset. I mean, he's like, this is a tragedy. Can you imagine? And I was like, sir, I have to go. I didn't say that. I was like, oh my gosh, it's crazy. And then I'm buying wings and they don't have them pre-packaged, which is fine. You know, it's bike week. They're all sold out. This guy comes up behind me. He's like, are you buying the wings? I'm like, Yes, sir. And he's like, oh, I tried to put in an order and they told me it was going to be 30 minutes. I'm like, in having a conversation with me, and I only have 18 minutes to get in and out and get Ella. It just was so crazy. But I have a bunch of stuff. I got the wings, so I almost forgot them naturally. But Ella, can you say hi, everybody? Hi, everyone. How was school today? How was school? Free toy. You played with toys? Free toys. Free toys? Yes. Say free is for me. New, new toy. Oh, there's new toys inside? Yep. What kind of toy? Show everybody your loose tooth. Yeah, her very front tooth. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Ah! It's so wiggly! Mm. Gonna fall. It's gonna fall out? 
Okay guys, so these are really what we're gonna have for dinners. I picked up a rotisserie chicken from Publix and I got some hot and spicy non-breaded wings. These are one of our staple and favorites. That's what dinner's gonna be and probably, I don't know, a bag of something. We'll show you what dinner looks like. But I got three bags of the Smart Sweets um, Swedish Fish. These are amazing. They don't work for everybody for weight loss, but they do work for me. I do have um, an affiliate link with them if you wanna order through my Instagram. Um, I do have a link and you can shop through and I think you save some money, but Mama needed them, them. I mean, I need them now. I need them now. So I got three bags of these at GNC and then I got two bags of the Quest chips at GNC. These ones are pretty good. I got these. I'm gonna try them let you know how they are. I got these at Publix. Chicken breast was buy one get one free, so I picked it up. Parchment paper. I got John and I each a bang for the morning and then I got some Cheez-Its for Ella, but I'm gonna try these. There's literally like two carbs for 23 crisps. The whole bag is four carbs. They're fine, they're not life changing. And we have to get a thumbnail. So I'll hold mine here. <laughs> you look really creepy. Okay, so. I was telling them this is day three for us on keto. Yeah. I'm down 2.3 the first day, 2.3 the second day, five pounds. And you're down 6.2 right now. I felt awful yesterday. I had heart palpitations. I felt terrible. Um, how'd you feel yesterday? I, I had the heart palps, but um, <laughs> I mean, I didn't feel terrible. Like The palps are annoying. I don't yeah. like that. I was going to say that's more of it. It's annoying. Uh, how are you feeling today? Feel good. Feel good. I got you a bang for the morning. Oh. Yeah, we feel pretty good today. I was surprised I felt so bad yesterday because usually I feel bad like four days later, not day two. Yeah, and I'm, I thought I would feel worse today than I did, but I feel good. So. I, yeah, I feel better today. So yeah. we're, we're hanging in there. It makes life a lot easier um, when you feel better yes. to not cheat because it's like really hard when you feel like garbage to not eat bad, but we did it and we're doing good and we feel good. I would also say the key is for me is I had a couple of those buys yesterday, the coconut waters. I think they really helped me a ton. Yeah, when you uh, when you feel like garbage, you eat like garbage, you look like garbage, so. Why are you staring at me as you say that? <laughs> We're gonna eat dinner. John, I got you the hot and spicy wings. I yes. will have to tell you the story about, I had to fight a guy off for those. Did you? They weren't pre-made in a box. Ooh. Yeah. Um, but he's gonna have wings. I also picked up a rotisserie chicken for us for the next couple of days. Those are super easy. I would highly suggest um, a rotisserie and just breaking it apart and having the meat on hand. And um, what else was I gonna say? Oh, I'm making pigs in a snuggie, so I'll show you guys those. We're gonna have a salad or spinach or something, right? Also, I picked up today. I saw you little cheese things in there. Oh. At Target. There you go. This butternut squash risotto, it really isn't bad. It's five net carbs per serving, so half a cup. Mm. It's yeah, not well, ideal, it's but between two people, I mean. yeah, we can make this work, yeah. and it's something different. And even if it's a little higher carb, I haven't ate much today. What did you eat? Um, I have those garden burgers. Okay, so yeah, we can definitely eat this. So we're gonna give this a try too and see if it's any good. So, California risotto. This is Parmesan cheese and sea salt cauliflower risotto. This one's even better. This is four carbs, four net carbs per serving. So we're gonna give one of these a try. Yeah. I'm excited because it's already flavored. That's always nice. Easy, fast food without having to go to a fast food place. We love that for us. Oh, I love that you just said that. I'm going to make um, fathead pigs in a Snuggie. Snuggie? What you need are cheese dogs. They're the best kind I would suggest for um, this particular recipe, but you can use any kind of sausage or hot dog. You need a cup and a half of shredded mozzarella cheese, one ounce of cream cheese, three fourth cup of almond flour, and one egg. So my fathead dough is super mushy. So the trick is to have your hands wet. Your fathead dough, if like you're not a pro like I am, I just like slap that bad boy in there and just like, put dough on top and then just marry the edges. It's not, it's not cute. Like Amanda's is really cute. I'll leave her video tagged up above. Um, but this, it works. So, you know, boom. 
Okay guys, these are what they look like. They're hot, they just came out of the oven. I wish I could show you a natural light without burning myself. Hold on. It's good. It's so good. A little sugar-free ketchup, mm-hmm. Um, we're not gonna eat yet, but I will show you what our dinner looks like plated up. If you guys like videos like this, make sure you let, leave me a comment down below and let me know. Also hit the like button, all those things. And I'll see you guys um, tomorrow. All right, bye friend. Okay guys, well this is dinner. I know it looks pretty underwhelming, but the cauliflower is actually really good and I've had a few wings, so. Easy peasy.